Hello everyone. I'd like to share with you a few trades posted by our graduate students and instructors on Monday, August 8th. Uh, this is a clip shared by uh, one of our traders who's consistent, MG. And as you see, he longed the uh, Nasdaq CFD. As you see, the trading chart is one minute and a structural five minute. And this is in uptrend pattern. So very high probability area as you see here the lower part of channel and higher part of channel uh, and he's taking this wave uh, within the bigger wave so this this one and and reaching the trying to reach this target at area that was previously a resistant and swing high and let me fast forward his trade he's trailing the stop loss and that's the end of his clip and reach the target so thanks mg for sharing this trade with us uh, then this picture was shared by yan our global instructor showing that uh, he used another e mini that has very high correlation with the nasdaq and dow jones and as you see uh, he is looking at macro structural and also trading channel as you see that shows the channel is going up he entered in right area as you see based on this channel here one minute chart uh, using the tick chart or 15 seconds to get better entry here so entry was here one force and exit one and two here so these are according to algo four five and entry signal thank you very much and for sharing your trade with us uh, the next clip is from castro our global instructor longing the uh, dow jones industrial average that was also in uptrend and as you see here the macro structural chart and trading chart this is trading chart and let me go this is his 15 minute structural chart showing the entry on this swing uh, quick scalp on this swing five minute chart as you see here the everything is according to algo one to five because we are in high probability trading area and the one minute chart is showing that is uh, trying to break this one and reach the target so i fast forward this one and that is the end of his trade then Castro shared this trade that he is shorting again uh, when the uh, Dow Jones reached this high and couldn't hold it so the price rejected at this level and it was breakout failure so it's a reversal trade so this is the candle this was three entry here with one target here previous support so this is kind of risky and only advanced trader can do it and he used uh, also order flow for confirmation yeah here this level got rejected at point of control and he's taking the profit at the middle at this point previous high here uh, which is an uh, value area low that is coming down to be retested so uh, that's close to his uh, end of clip so this is risk amount these are uh, you see the reward which is three times at least more uh, this seems to be another trade after reaching this point uh, there was another retest here so again he saw this as an opportunity now this is coming down as a trend and you can see this this here after going through this and take profit goes up retest and coming back and you see opportunity that now that enter at this value area high level and you can see it on fib also and then enter and aim for the lower part which is this area um, of previous support area thanks for sharing these three trades Castro with us 
and Yasin shared picture of this trade with us uh, who's shorting the S&P 500 uh, e-mini contract on his $25,000 combine and got uh, reached a profit so he's gonna send the video separately and thanks Yasin for sharing this trade with us Ren also sent this one that he shorted the S&P 500 CFD and this is his one minute chart and as you see this was in downtrend here so again I think it took another reversal here based on this channel so thanks Ren for sharing this trade with us and everyone hope you have a, a great day and let us know if you have any questions